Hello, in this Kotlin programming video, we are actually going to be doing some Java programming. Just some, some, something really simple. I'm going to show you how you can call Java code from a Kotlin file. So first of all, we need some Java code. So if you've ever added a file, created a file, doesn't matter. I'm going to create one in the source directory. So right click new Java class. I'm going to call it epic class in here. I'm going to create a method public static of the void and the method name is going to be print so we're going to keep it really simple in this system dot out dot print line and this is just going to print out hello world to actually access this class we just go to the kotlin file just do the name of the class or epic class dot you know what whatever we at whatever property we are accessing now if I run it we get hello world being printed out it's that simple the method could be a bit more complex you could have parameters in there you uh, and you know naturally you can pass parameters through you could have you know variables here so for create a variable public static int and let's say if I have a variable called epic var and if we go to the Kotlin file if I were to do epic class dot epic var equals nine then if I was just do a print line of epic class dot epic var we'll get nine printed out in our little console right here momentarily there we go it's that simple obviously you did the class i mean the method and the variables don't have to be static they can be non-static and you can create an instance of the class and that is the same essentially in here as if it was a kotlin class so uh, the code is interchangeable you can do a lot with it so it's just something that you either can't do in kotlin or you don't know and you or maybe you've already got some amazing library set up and coded in java just import it in and you can use it in Kotlin, it's that simple. If you have any questions and you want some help, feel free to pop me a message. And as usual, I look forward to seeing you in the next video.